Let me show you how I get 100 out of 100 for my website, page speed score for mobile devices and even for desktop. You can see FCP, LCP, total bucket time, everything is super amazing. In this video, we're gonna optimize your cloud-based website in 4G steps. Depending on website size, plugins you're using and complexity of the website, you might have different scores. But if you get anywhere more than 80, 90, that's a really good score. Don't wait too much about to getting 100 out of 100, how I got on my website. If you're not on Cloudways, you want to switch to Cloudways, I have really nice discount for you in the description of the video. And if you want, you can use the coupon code to get extra 20% discount. Okay, so the step one will be to optimize the server setting. So log into Cloudways account and then you will see your server, click on the server. And the first thing you need to do here is click on manage services. And now make sure that Redis and Varnish, they both are enabled. If they're not enabled, please enable them. Usually they're enabled, but just to do the extra check, Make sure these two options they are enabled. Okay, now the important thing is click on setting and packages. So when you click on setting and packages, click on packages. And then guys from here, make sure this PHP version is set to minimum 8.0. I'm sure most of you will have your PHP version 7.4, but make sure minimum it's set to 8.0. If you want, you can check other versions also. So minimum select 8.0. Then you see this warning that your website might break. Click on continue. You can see, please wait while server package is being updated and it's possible when you try to exit your website your website says service unavailable because right now the php version is upgrading so it might take some time and you might see this warning once this process is done you need to refresh your website and if you see your website is loading perfectly fine then there's no issue with the php upgrading but yes if you see your website is broken you see some errors on your website or for very long time the website is not available go back to the php version packages please wait for few minutes if the php is updating and then once you see this page click on modify and roll back to the previous version of php and then click on continue once you do this process you revert the original php version which we were using before then your website will be back let's go to step two of optimizing your wordpress website on cloudways go to applications and then select your wordpress website you want to optimize and then guys make sure you click here on ssl certificate and you need to make sure a SSL certificate is applied on your website. If your website doesn't have a valid SSL certificate, your website might have errors and it will be very slow because your website contains a lot of different connections coming from other websites. For example, use free plugins and free services. When you do not have SSL installed on your website, there's some problem with those incoming connections with another website and other services. So make sure you select Let's Encrypt SSL and then enter your email here and then enter the domain name of your website. And then click on install certificate. If you face any issue while applying the SSL certificate, Cloudway support is really nice. You just contact them, send them a message. You can click on need a hand. And then from here, send us a message. And then from here, you can select technical help and ask them to install the SSL certificate on your website. It will take just few minutes to install a valid SSL certificate on your website. And just by adding SSL certificate, your website will be already much faster. Okay, now let's go to the third and very important point. So we're gonna need to install Breeze plugin. By default, it is plugin installed on all Cloudways website. But if you don't see Breeze plugin installed on the website, what you can do, go to plugins, click on add new. And then from here, you can search Breeze. This plugin is available to be used on any website, but yes, this plugin works best with a Cloudways hosting. You will see option here, install now, click on install now. And once it is installed, click on activate. Once the Breeze plugin is activated, you'll find this option under settings here, and then click on Breeze. And now the first thing you will have basic option and guys make sure the cache system is enabled here. This is the most important option which will make your website really fast. Mobile cache, you do not need this option if you're using an advanced theme which is responsive. In most of the cases, just forget about this option. And then after make sure gzip compression is enabled here. It really helps to compress your files when they are downloaded to the user's computer. And then also browser cache is important. Because when somebody opens your website, if this option is checked, they do not need to download all the generic files again and again, like CSS file, images, all these files. Once they open your website, all these files will be downloaded on the user's computer. So it will make your website really fast to load on the user's computer. And then guys, lazy load images, do not check this option. Sometimes it might be problematic. It can increase the problem of LCP on Google Page Speed Score. Rest everything on this page, you can leave just like this and click on save. And then we come to file optimization. Now guys, I'm telling you most important options here and please make sure you watch this part carefully. So make sure STM Minify is enabled, CS Minify is enabled, Include Inline CS is enabled, Combine CS is enabled, JSS Minify enabled, Include Inline JS, Combine JS enabled. And then click on Save Changes. 
Now what you need to do is you need to go back to website. Now to check your website, refresh if website is breaking or not. In case you see some issue with the website design, what you need to do is go back to the breeze and from here and then go scroll down the page and from bottom here, first disable this option combines JS, inline JS and JS minify. Disable all the option of JavaScript optimization and then save changes. Now go back to website, check if the problem is resolved. If the problem is resolved, that means JavaScript optimization options were breaking website. If problem does not resolve, it means JavaScript optimization was not an issue. Enable those back again, all these three options, and then now disable all these three options for CSS optimization. And now save changes. Now go back to website, refresh the website. Now the issue should be resolved. And now if you see the issue resolved, go back to here and now enable all this option. And now one by one, disable this option and then save changes. Go back to website and see if the website is working fine or not. If the website is working fine, it means this option was breaking your website. I'm not going to create a super detailed video on this option. I already have so many videos on my channel where I explain advanced troubleshooting when JavaScript or CSS break your website. So if you want to check that useful video, check the link in description where I explain all this option in detail. One by one, enable and disable them to see which option is breaking the site and do not use this option again. Then go to preload, make sure preload links is checked. Then go to advanced options and then guys make sure here disable emoji is checked, host file locally is checked, Google fonts, Google analytics, Facebook pixel, Gravita. What happens? Instead of getting all these files from these servers, from Google, from Google analytics, from Facebook, Breeze plugin will store these files on your own server and time to time it will refresh the file if there is new update available for these files. It's a really nice option and it will increase your website speed significantly. And then click on save changes. And then the option heartbeat API, you can leave the option just like this. In most of cases, you don't need to touch this option. Click on database option and guys please make sure before using this option, take a backup website. But yes, you can click on optimize database. This is mostly safe option. You can click on optimize to optimize the database of your Cloudways website. Once you click optimize, it will clean the database of your WordPress website on Cloudways hosting. And then guys, we have CDN. If you want, you can enable it and set up a self-hosted CDN. But usually Cloudways is already fast hosting. If, if you want, you can use the Cloudflare Enterprise version provided directly by Cloudways hosting. I think it costs around $5 per month. If you want, you can use that option. And then your varnish, varnish option. Make sure it is auto purge checked. For example, if you make some changes on the website but you cannot see those changes in front end or website looks broke, click on parse here. What it will do, it will clear the cache of the website. So if you made any changes on the website, now they will reflect on the front end. And then, then we have tools. So here you can download all settings and then if you click on reset now, the plugin will be set to the default settings it comes with. And rollback version, in case you updated Breeze plugin and it broke your website, what you can do, you can roll back to a previous version which were not breaking your website. Okay, once you do all these settings, you go back to test your website, click on analyze and it will already increase your website speed significantly. You can see now I'm scoring already 93 for mobile devices, FCP, LCP is good, total blocking time is zero. Everything's really good. This big issue with the images here, you see, serve image in next gen format here and we have three images which are not optimized and then LCP issue also which is again coming because of the images. So for that, what I will do, I will go back to my WordPress admin panel, go to plugins, click on add new. And now I'll search here, WebP Express here. And then I'll install the first plugin. You can see it has more than 300,000 plus active installation. Click on install now. You can use other optimization plugins also, but yes, I think WebP Express works real nice. Click on activate. And now go to settings and you'll find this plugin here, WebP Express. And then scroll the page. And then you'll see the option bulk convert. When you click bulk convert, you will see how many files they are ready to be converted and then click on start conversion. I created a complete video on WebP Express plugin. If you want, I will add the link in the description of this video. So once all the WebP images converted, I got 100 out of 100 score for both mobile and extra devices. And guys, I request you is really important. Do not worry too much about 100 out of 100 scores. If you're getting anywhere more than 80, 90, they're really good scores. Focus more on the quality of the content of your website. If you get any help from this video, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel. And if you want to optimize your website speed using Lightspeed Cache plugin, check this video on screen. And if you want to optimize your website using WP Rocket plugin, check this video on screen.